All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. And I'm Tom Brush. And today we are going to be watching Labyrinth. Um, I do not know anything about this movie except that David Bowie is in it and it's a famous 80s movie. It came out in 1986. You were like Pan's Labyrinth, and I was like, yeah. no, Labyrinth. <laughs> So I don't really know a lot about this movie. I just know it's one of those popular 80s movies, kind of right along with Never Ending Story, which I don't really know a lot about either. It's just one of those popular 80s movies. So we're watching it on our 80s binge. This is going to be a blast. I'm very, very, very excited. And yeah, I really just want to get into it. So as always, full-length reactions up on our Patreon. Next week, 80s movie is also going to be up on our Patreon. Whichever movie you guys voted for up there, this movie here. That's also up there for you guys to go ahead and check out. And really just thank you for being here, guys. Thank you for watching. If you're new here, welcome. Uh, hopefully you stick around. We would love to have you. And if you do, um, I don't know why I said that. We would love to have you. Uh, now let's just get into Labyrinth. Oh, Lucasfilm. Dang. Jim Henson. Isn't that... I weirdly feel like I recognize that name. I think it's a comic book. The guy who wrote... Or no... No, oh, it's the... Isn't those the puppets? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is really cool with the owl. And they're like, whoa. I have no idea what this movie what is. What the heck? <laughs> and the opening thing reminds me of Top Gun. <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. Now, I wonder if there's going to be a lot of, like, puppeteering. Like, practical effects. I feel like there might be. Maybe because of the... Uh, Henson? Jim Henson or whatever you were saying. <laughs> That's so cool. It's very interesting. It's like very minimalistic, but also still really cool. Yeah, the choice to use like certain effects. It's, I don't know what to say. It's very unique. Like, yeah, it's a little bit artsy kind of like, yeah, you know, like why there's no real. Whoa, no, that cool. was cool. That was a clean transition too. Give me the child. Wait, what? I have fought my way here to the castle beyond the Goblin City. Take back the child that you have stolen. I did not expect this. For my will is as strong as yours. My kingdom is great. Is this like an acting Maybe. or something? Oh, I can never oh yeah, 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 it is. It feels like that. You have no power over me. <laughs> Whoa, a sheepdog. I like bows. Oh no, Merlin. I don't believe it. It's seven o'clock. Okay, but this is a beautiful, like... Like acting or no? Where is this? This is awesome. Yeah, it's like the perfect spot to do that. Yeah. <laughs> I like how you can see her jeans underneath the dress. So. <laughs> yeah. I have to say, I already love the vibe of this movie. Yeah. I, I can't really put my finger on it, but with the, the Bowie music and just the wide shots and the way it just it feels. I'm sorry. Well, don't stand there in the rain. Come on. Oh, oh no. Not Shoot, dude. Yeah, you can't. Oh. You gotta help that dog or something. I mean. I love dogs, but that's gonna be a. <laughs> it's gonna be that's a nightmare gonna be in the a house. Big mess. She treats me like a wicked stepmother in a fairy story, no matter what I say. I'll talk to her. You know, it's she's a teenager. I feel like it's like I don't even know if either of the things they're saying is true. It's just kind of like the teenage. I have fought my way here to the castle, beyond the Goblin City. She seems to be very into that, um, the like the fairy tales and yeah. stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She wants to like act. Yeah, and like acting. Yeah. Lot. Someone has been in my room. <laughs> All these, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Merlin, Lancelot. She's very into the, uh, I hate you! Someone take me away from this awful place! <laughs> <laughs> Poor baby. Once upon a time, there was a beautiful young girl whose stepmother always made her stay home with the baby. It's not his fault! <laughs> child. This poor baby. No one knew. Oh, dang. The, the weather's helping the you out here a little bit. <laughs> so one night, when the baby had been particularly cruel to her, she called on the goblins for help. <laughs> the baby had been particularly cruel. <laughs> oh, whoa. Say your right words, and we'll take the baby to the goblin city. Oh, no. And you will be free. Don't do anything. <sighs> Wait, is this real? It might be. And turn it into a goblin. All right, all right. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, she didn't say anything. No, like... no, no, she didn't. She didn't. I'll say the words. No, I mustn't. No, dude, come on, don't say it. I wish. This is how you say it. Say what? Dude, this is so creepy. Like. Goblin King, wherever you may be, take this child of mine far away from me. Um. Uh oh. Dude. 
not eat. Oh, excellent. That rubbish. It doesn't even start with I wish. <laughs> That's hilarious. I wonder where they are. Like, I wish. Uh oh. I wish. Did you say it? <laughs> <laughs> Help this poor baby. Come on, man. I wish the goblins would come and take you away. Oh, oh no. no, dude. Well, dude, and then she's not even gonna see. Well, I mean. I like how she kind of has this like half belief too. It's very interesting. Well, yeah, cause I mean, she is very into the whole. Yeah. Well, it's almost like she truly wishes for it. She doesn't, you know, it's like if you're wishing upon a star. Kobe, are you all right? Um. Uh-oh, now you're actually gonna have to do something. Yeah, that's what happens when... Oh, what the heck? That's freaky. Oh, oh, shoot, the owl. Oh, what the heck? You see that thing? That's so cool, actually. You see him, like, sneaking around? Yeah. What the... Oh. <laughs> that's cool. Whoa, let the owl in. Hey, the owl protect you, bro. Oh, what the heck? Oh my gosh, it's David Bowie. I've brought you a gift. Whoa, that was cool. What is it? It's a crystal. Nothing more. <laughs> but this is not a gift for an ordinary <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Do you want it? Then forget the baby. Whoa, dude. I want my brother back. He must be so scared. Sarah. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! The heck? Don't defy me. What the heck? Whoa! Oh, that's that was cool. really cool. But I have to have my brother back. I thought she was gonna be like working with him. I didn't think he was gonna be like the antagonist. Do you still want to look for him? Oh, what? dude, it's like Is a. That, I had assumed it'd be like kind of like her story, you. right? Turn back, Sarah. That she was acting out in the beginning. Whoa. You have 13 hours in which to solve the labyrinth before your baby brother becomes one of us forever. Uh oh. I really love the the kind of mystical feel and, and the design of everything. Yeah. The clock appearing out of nowhere. Just stuff like that. It's really, really cool. It feels a little bit abstract. kind of. Yeah, like, it does. Um, reminds me of an episode of the Looney Tunes. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> And I like how it, it, it feels very 80s, but then it also has this fantasy. Like, like you know, the Goblin King design. It's like, okay, what does that hair do? Like, it's not like Lord of the Rings, but it works. Oh, whoa. Oh, how sweet. 57. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Poor thing. You monster. I don't know. Be careful. You bit me. <laughs> what did you expect fairies to do? <laughs> you do nice things. What? That's not what I hear about oh, fairies in uh, stories. Horrible. No, I ain't. I'm Hoggle. Who are you? <laughs> Fifty-nine. I like this guy. Do you guy. know where the door to the labyrinth is? Ah, now that's more like it. Is he a puppet? I feel like there's someone in it. I do too. I mean, it's kind of puppet, right? Because the face. Really going in there, are you? Huh. Yes. I'm afraid I have to. But even Come like on, the fairies Sarah. in the background, like they they look really good. Like yes. them flying around and stuff. And and I can tell these are all practical sets. Yeah. Right? Like you can see that it's made practically, even if like the backdrops and stuff are a little Whoa. Whoa, that's cool. It's really cool. We have entered the labyrinth. Cozy, isn't it? For some reason I wasn't really thinking of labyrinth like like in the, the strict definition, but it makes sense. Would you go left or right? That's not what you do. Same. Well, you're not gonna get very far. <laughs> okay, bro. You take too many things for granted. <laughs> what if you go over? Yeah, I was thinking, is there like a little spot right there that you can go through? Yeah. Thanks for nothing, Hogwart. Ow, it's Hoggle! And don't <laughs> say I didn't warn you. Yeah, she needs to she needs to learn a little bit. A little bit a little bit bratty. Okay, well she's read a lot of fantasy, right? So it's like Oh, that's creepy. Whoa. That's creepy. I'm hoping she's like a horror protagonist who's not, you know what I mean? Like if we, you know, she's got some experience. She knows what she's doing, hopefully. Maybe she's a little cocky. towards the end, I feel. I, I don't see her being able to do anything much. I feel like things are just going to happen to her and she's going to have to learn. I'm just hoping like like with her fairy tale experience. What do they mean, Labyrinth? There are any turns or corners or anything. This just goes on and on. 
So maybe you gotta go over, bro. It doesn't. Maybe I'm just taking it for granted that it does. <laughs> this feels like a like a, a video game. I'm not gonna lie. It does. Like even like the soundtrack and stuff, <laughs> and the whole setting, like yeah. everything. Yeah, I'm trying to see. Is there like, is it is it just is it like a optical illusion that it goes straight? Could be. Or I feel like it could turn at any point, and yeah. you just wouldn't be able to tell. Yeah, because there could be hallways on either side. It's like hard to see. You're a worm, aren't you? Yeah, shot. I would be so afraid. It's like, is worm a derogatory term? Like, <laughs> come inside, meet the missus. No, thank you. Uh, but I have to solve this labyrinth. But there aren't any turns or any openings or anything. Well, he just invited you inside. You try walking through it. You'll see what I mean. Wait, what? what? Go on, go on then. How can he tell? That's just wall. Just try it. You can't take anything for granted. Hey. <sighs> Whoa, that was so cool. <laughs> I thought it was going to be like a fake wall. I didn't think it was like an optical. That's really cool. You kept on going down that way. Should have gone straight to that castle. Oh, what? Gosh, Bro. darn it. Ooh, poor baby, dude. Toby. He just gave him a piece of bread. <laughs> I love the designs of like... Whoa, we're doing a musical, bro? A oh, dang. Oh, snap. I'm kinda into this, man. Okay, are we sure we don't want to party with the goblins, though? I'm just saying. Yeah, I mean, like, is that really the worst thing to become a goblin? <laughs> Especially when he's the king, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh no! Just kick the chicken! Like, I'm not gonna lie, the baby's not crying anymore. <laughs> he's kind of into it. Oh! Okay. Oh, that's cool. That's good. <laughs> Who ruined my roof? <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. No, really? Is it the same... Is it the same person? He's like, bro, you're... <laughs> he's like, why do you keep drawing my... <laughs> he's like, what is happening? Yeah, he's just, he's just confused. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you can tell, like, some of them are, like, kind of suits or something, and then some of them are, like, puppet puppets, yeah. you know? Yeah, but they do a good job of integrating them. Yeah. And even having that, like, with a baby on set, I can't even imagine. Like, are those, like, puppets holding the baby? Like, that's crazy. Dang. And the ones, like, jumping and stuff? <laughs> Yeah, see, he's got the moves, bro. Dude, I think the baby might want to stay here. Like, is that a real Dude. vulture up there? Oh my gosh! Dude, I want to know who this baby is now. <laughs> <laughs> he's the Goblin King. <laughs> Dude. Oh my gosh, you're, you're trying. <laughs> <laughs> They've had enough. Oh no. Someone has been changing my marks. It's not fair. That's right. It's not fair. Yeah, I mean, whoa. This was a dead end a minute ago. No, that's the dead end behind you. What the heck? Day changed. Well, the that's only way weird. Out of here is to try one of these doors. You're a door? One of them leads to the castle at the center of the labyrinth. The other one leads to bum, 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 bum. certain death. <laughs> which one is which? Oh, yeah, that, let's <laughs> just tell you our plan. I should warn you that one of us always tells the truth. And one of us all was Okay, dying. you guys are making these rules up now. This is... Would he tell me that this door leads to the castle? Yes. <laughs> then... Okay. The other door leads to the castle, and this door leads to certain death. Wait, how? But I could be telling the truth. But then he would be lying. So if he told me that he said yes, I know the answer would uh, still be no. Wait, what? Is that right? Yeah. I don't know. I've never understood it. <laughs> me neither. I think I'm getting smarter. It's a piece of cake. Oh my gosh! Oh no! Bro! What the heck? That's cool. This is so cool. We are helping hands. You're hurting! Whoa. Which way do you want to <laughs> This go? is so Whoa. cool. The different ways that they make faces is really cool. It, it, it like builds the personality. Whoa. Whoa. That is so cool. Okay, this movie is awesome. It's very, very interesting it's and It's so unique, well like. made. She'll soon give up when she realizes she has to start all over again. <laughs> oh, no. Well, love. <laughs> I feel like you may be wrong. I knew you were going to get into trouble as soon as I met you. So I've come to give you a hand. By taking you back to the beginning. If you help me solve the labyrinth, I'll give you this. You like yeah. it, don't you? So-so. <laughs> 
She's starting to play the game a little more. Yes, like. yes, yes, yes. And not be so cocky. What is that, anyway? Plastic. Whoa. <laughs> I'll take you as far as I can. <laughs> you're on your own. Plastic? That's valuable here. We don't have that. Here we go. That's cool. Whoa. Room closet. It's like a magic <laughs> door. <laughs> Go back while you still can. Dude. This is not the way. Can somebody make this into like a ride? Like, can you imagine walking through this? It feels like an amusement yeah, park, almost. like Sting or something. Oh no, I feel like they're telling the truth. What have we here? Uh, uh, nothing. Who is this? Nothing. Nothing. Whoa. Oh Nothing. no. Tra -la -la. Oh no. Hello, Hedgewort. Hogwart. Hoggle. <laughs> you guys. Hogwart? Did that inspire Hogwarts? Maybe. But actually, what is that plastic thing round your wrist? Ew. Now, please. <laughs> hey, just say you stole it. If I thought for one second that you were betraying me, I'd be forced to suspend you headfirst in the bog of eternal stench. I don't know. Oh my oh, gosh, no. the bog of eternal stench? That does not sound right. We ain't going there. How are you enjoying my labyrinths? She's beating it, thank you very much. If you didn't use hey. cheat codes, bro, and come down here. How about upping the sticks? Hmm? What? It's not fair. You say that so often. Wonder what your basis for comparison is. Heh, <laughs> it's true. That is, yeah. Whoa. That was cool. Whoa, what is that? It's like a drill. That is so cool. Dude, that is awesome. Oh, of you know, course. Are you kidding me? Come on, come on, come on. Everything is not how it seems. Everything is not as it seems. How do we use that? Seems like a door or something. Yeah. Okay. Ew. Oh. Why are they called the cleaners? They're out here, like, <laughs> <laughs> they're making a mess. Oh, no. Me. How can I trust you now that I know you were taking me back to the beginning? I don't think he was taking you back to the beginning. Yeah. I told him I was taking you back to the beginning just to throw him off the scent. Yeah, he clearly fell for your bribe. Let me put it this way. What choice have you got? Yeah. It's true. I mean, you can't trust anybody, the labyrinth or this guy, so but he's more He's gotten you farther than anyone else has. I'm a coward, and Jareth scares me. Jareth? Is that his name? Put a foot in the bog of stench, you'll smell bad for the rest of your life. Oh, oh no. That is messed up. That's not cool. Uh, Whoa. You're on your own from now on. Wait, this is so, so cool. I've got no pride. Oh, yeah? <laughs> but that was my clothes. <laughs> now, there's the castle. Which way should we talk? I mean, she's playing the game. Yeah, right? It's like you can't trust anybody. Everybody's kind of a little bit like tricky and like it. So she's got to play the game. Whoa. Lord Shen? Honestly. Mm -hmm. But just, you know, after a lot's happened. Oh. Hey, Whoa. Uh, that was cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And who is this? Hm. My friend. Hoggle. The way forward is sometimes the way back. Hm. Okay, but what does that mean, bro? <laughs> Quite often, young lady. It seems like we're not getting anywhere when in fact we are. We are. Okay, bro, you're stealing all his dramatic timing. That's your lot. Please leave a contribution in the little box. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> uh you gotta donate? Well, she's not donating any of her stuff, probably oh, okay, well. Oh day. I guess I can spare this. <laughs> <laughs> it's so stimulating being your head. <laughs> you may not be much for a friend, but you're the only friend I've gotten this place. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, do you hear something? Uh, yes. Uh, it's alright. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been no one's friend before. <laughs> it is so funny how. Whoa. Whoa. He's freaky. What the heck? They, like, captured it. Yeah. Something to throw. Oh, um. <laughs> that rock. <laughs> hey, that oh, was day. a good throw, though. That was a good throw. <laughs> Where are these rocks coming from? Like someone or they're like helping her out somehow. <laughs> Dang. 
game. Um, can she get on some sports teams, please? <laughs> They're like, it, we're too much for each other. <laughs> you seem like such a nice beast. Just hang on. This is really interesting. Oh, he could have done that a little slower. I, I don't think she would have been able to support. That's true. Support the way, he dude, Ludo's huge. That's right, Ludo. I'm Sarah. We're getting allies. Good allies, bro. Yeah. Look at him. Sarah, friend. <laughs> Do you know the way? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> How to get through this labyrinth. Get through the labyrinth. Get through the labyrinth. She'll never get through the labyrinth. What? Which would you choose out of these two ugly characters? It's very rude mm. to stare. Whoa. Okay. Wait a second. Cause he has the things in his that's so cool. I said it's no good talking to him. He step as a pole. Mamble, mamble, mamble. <laughs> well maybe you can help him out. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. The way that they like do it, it's really cool. Yes. Uh oh. Can <laughs> he Wait, could he have like grunted a little loudly, please? This is beautiful. Oh, he can get him. I thought he wouldn't be able to. I feel like you gotta trust Ludo's instincts. <laughs> okay, but... It's got my eyes. Ludo's scared. Give me your hand. Come on. Imagine a big thing like you being scared. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like uh if you can convince him to Oh, uh, excuse me, Ludo. Ludo! Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. It's right there. It's like a trap door. Ludo! Whoa. Ludo! What? That's a cool, uh... Oh, oh, that's so cool. Yeah. Help! I'm coming, Sarah. Well... Uh-oh. Whoa. I've just noticed your lovely jewels are missing. Uh... Oh, yes! Wait, but you can use that oh, as like a... Oh, no. I mean, find him. But first... I'm off to take the little lady back to the beginning of the labyrinth. He should have said that she stole them, and so she's trying to get to... Yeah, but... Give her this. Uh, what? What, what is it? It's like a poisoned peach or something. It ain't gonna hurt the little lady, is it? Oh, now why the concern? Yeah, it totally is. Look at this guy. And Hoggle, if she ever kisses you, I'll turn you into a prince. Y you will? Prince of the land of stench. <laughs> oh, what? He just pulled the reverse Uno, he bro. Just, <laughs> he's so like that is not cool, so King mean. of the Goblins. What's going on? Yeah. What is going on? What do you want? What type of creatures are these? Interesting. They're using some. What, what are they using? Like to do these people? Well, no. It's like they're putting them onto the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is, is it green screen? Yeah, I think, I think so. Dang, it, it's a party Dang. everywhere, bro. Dang, the, these dance moves, for especially for like... Oh, <laughs> what the? <laughs> this is such a strange movie. Whoa. These are, these are good moves. <laughs> All right, we need to get these guys an agent, man. They're gay. <laughs> what the heck? This is so strange. <laughs> <laughs> she's not the same creature as you guys. Yeah, they're like, wait, this is wrong. Take off her head. Hey, that's my head. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. The plays, she's such Sarah. A violent, terrible person. This is a kid's movie. This is unacceptable. She just ripped all their heads off. She's decapitating all these people. You want to take your head off, don't you? Oh, go. shoot. Okay, okay. Go, 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 go. Book it. Take off your ear. <laughs> it reminds me of, like, fantasy books and stuff I've read, but, like, the, like, playful, like, evil mischief. Where it's not, like... Yeah. Whoa. Oh, great. Are you serious? Hold on. Oh, my god. It's the body of stench. Is it? Is it? Ah, what is it? 
with the mark of eternal stains. Help him! Help him! Is it because he she kissed him? <laughs> Ew, dude. <laughs> Pull him up! Come on, come on, come on! Pull this dude up! Don't kiss me! Whoa! I know you came back to help me, and I know that you're my friend. Did not, am not. <laughs> what about Ludo? What about oh, that's other true. friend? Give you. Give me what? Oh, God, do Wait, it. worry about that. Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa. <gasps> well, there's Ludo. Ludo. Okay. How do we get to get out? Like, we're not in in the bog, but we're basically in the bog. Yeah. There's a bridge. Come on. Oh, bro. You're going to go through Ow. here? Ooh, dude. Look at that huge freaking, like, mosquito thing. Yeah. Stop. Oh, no. <laughs> We've got to get out of this stench. Smell bad. Stench? Of what speakers thou? Wait, can he not smell it? I Maybe smell he's nothing. been here for a Tell long time or something. But he's all dressed nicely. Whoa! He's got skills! Dude. Watch out! I don't to <laughs> kind of. I can conquer this mountain! <laughs> I like this character. Okay. Oh, okay, that's unacceptable. Okay, come on, Sarah, do something, dude. Whoa. Oh. Okay. It's a little feisty. Whoa. Oh, that's cool. Enough! <laughs> Before this day, never have I met my match in battle. Yet this noble knight has put me to a stand. You really haven't fought a lot of people. Let us be brothers henceforth and fight for the right as one. Sure. Whatever you say, bro. Hey, listen, I'm down. Wait a minute. Oh, no. You forget my sacred vow, my lady. And I must defend it to the death. Uh-oh. Is there a way to... What? Exactly, have you sworn? I oh, have sworn yeah. with my life blood. No one shall pass this way without my permission. Okay, okay, so but how do you give us your permission? permission? May we have your permission? Well, I. Uh, uh, huh, for your brother. Yes? Thank you, noble sir. My lady. <laughs> Oh, dude, this is sketchy, bro. Yeah. This is I like. I don't know if Ludo's gonna be able to make it across that thing. <laughs> I feel like that's uh, the problem. Oh, you just broke the thousand year bridge. Oh my gosh. How? <laughs> English, bro. He could barely she speak. Is he calling somebody? <gasps> yeah. Oh, he can move rocks. That's why he was doing it. Wait, he can move rocks? Yeah. What the heck? Can't stop summon up the very rocks. Sure, rocks friends. Dang, that's awesome. Ludo's a, a powerful ally. Yeah. Careful, Ludo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's all right, Ambrosius. You can cover up now. Wait, Ambrosius? That's, it's a sheepdog. Is that not, isn't it? Ambrosius, looks like, um, it looks like dog? Merlin. Yeah, but it's exactly, it's. Let's get out of here. I, 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 is there a chance this is like the Wizard of Oz a little bit? It could be. And I don't know if they're trying to do that on purpose, where it's like ambiguous or. I wouldn't do that. If I Whoa. <laughs> yeah, it's weird because like he can see them or something, you know, because. Yeah. With the crystal ball or something. Because, like, how did he know that she yeah. kissed him? Yeah. I'm still, like, trying to figure out whether or not he's, like, trying to teach her something. Or is he, is he legitimately bad, you know? I think he is. I'll soon forget all about you, my fine fellow. How? Just as soon as Huggle gives him my present. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah. Well... We can't stop now. Wait, honestly, the more that I think about it, this is a lot like The Wizard of Oz. Where it's like she's going through this thing. Yeah. She's gathering friends. It's yeah, it does an feel... evil witch, like, looking through the thing. I wonder if that's that's purposeful. It might be. It's gotta be. No, bro. What? Oh, no. This tastes strange. Don't trust it. She already oh, bit it. Done. Oh. Damn you, Jerry. And damn me too. 
Oh no. Shoot. How is she gonna get past this? Everything's dancing. That's crazy. He's really good at um doing that. What do they call? What is that? Um, like sleight of hand? No, there's a toy that a glass ball that you would play with back then. Oh, I don't know. No, is it? No idea what you're talking about. What? Those are like glimpses her... of her room. Yeah. Is he sending those out to try to like um implant weird memories? Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, like, oh, did you just forget <laughs> about Sarah? <laughs> We were right there too. It's literally right there. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I feel like he's like replacing her memory with like with like what she wants, like her daydreams. Yeah, it was almost like um what he was tempting her with yeah, in the yeah, beginning, yeah, kinda. Yeah. yeah, shoot, dude. Okay, that is like stunning set design and like costumes though. It's always very like um it's not like normal. It's no. always very unique and like they add this um different sort of twist to yeah. it. Yeah. Even the environment, like look at all the candles like Yeah. This was every girl's fantasy of the 80s. I mean, this is not just her. <laughs> the way that there's this weird shimmer that distorts everything just a yeah. tiny bit is really cool. But it's subtle. How is she going to get out of this, man? I feel like her friends have to help out or something. Yes, or, I think so too. I have no idea. I feel like there's a name for this aesthetic and I don't quite know what it is. But somebody tell us in the comments. Like, this is a particular kind of like with the masks and the hats and the... Well, I mean, it feels very like... Victorian s a little bit, but I almost feel like it's like steampunk. You know, it's like a subgenre or something like that. Yeah. Oh no, dude. It's kind of like her story in a way, yeah, but yeah. the other the other thing is like her story as well. Come on, Jennifer, or not Jennifer, Sarah. How are we gonna get out of here? Oh. No. Is she literally oh, she trapped break out? inside. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. That is so cool. What? What? Where are we? Where did we end up? I don't know. It's like this forgotten dreams or something. Uh, dude. She ended up like right there. She's probably right next to you. <laughs> Ew. Ew. Ah. Why don't you look where you're going, young woman? Jeez. You think she doesn't have enough on her back already? <laughs> oh. Well, look here. Mm -hmm. <gasps> That's Lancelot. That's that would be enough. What? It's her place. What the heck? Don't fall for this, dude. Your brother's not here. But will this give her memories of her brother? Mm-mm. I think this is like this is like a temptation. Yeah, I mean it very much could be. Oh jeez. I think we need um Hoggle's help. Yeah. Oh, there's Betsy Boo. You remember Betsy Boo, don't you? Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's like she's looking for everything she ever lost in her life. Yeah. Here's a treasure. You'll want that, won't you, my dear? Yes. I wonder if it's like things that she... And here's come on, remember the makeup. Remember. Right yeah, see? That w that should... Come on. There's Charlie Bear for you. Hmm? There's the so Wizard of Oz book, right? Uh, yeah. The Labyrinth? Isn't that the story? Yeah. That she was, uh... Take back the child that you have stolen. <gasps> Yes. Don't you like your toys? Dude, it's like she's trying to make her like one of them, too. Like, she's, like, piling all her stuff on top That's of her. That's true. You're right. Like, I wonder if it's, like, the origin almost. Of them, yeah. Yeah. Yes, it is. Whoa. Let's go. Cool. Destroy it. Dude, get out of there, bro. Get out. Hey. Our squad. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, good thing you made friends with these people, man. These people are coming through. Yep. Let's go quickly. We don't have much time. Yeah. Right. Hoggle, come on. You have a second no, chance. No. 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 Open up. Whoa. Open the door. We must go quietly. Whoa. Shh. 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 Careful. It's a goblin city, right? So. I'm not a coward. No. And my sense of smell is keen. Oh. And I shall fight anyone, anywhere! No, 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 no! Now hush! We don't need that right now. Go <laughs> on, Sir Denimus. You gotta be quiet now. <laughs> I smell trouble. Uh, yeah. Oh, no! What the heck? Oh, oh, it's like those are the real gates. Oh, no! Be oh like no, some, is it gonna come to life? Some sort of like puzzle or something? No, 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 it's gonna come out, bro. Boss fight! Oh, jeez, dude. Come on, guys. 
<gasps> what the heck? This no, is so it has cool. Freaking come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, take it down, take it down. Dang. <laughs> Sir Didymus, come on, step up. Whoa! Can we get around him or something, maybe? I don't know. Is there like some sort of like, you know, like weak spot or yeah. oh, oh! Hoggle, go, bro, hoggle! Yo! <laughs> it's like a Jaeger. Dude. <laughs> Can he, can we use it? Yeah. Oh yeah, boy. <laughs> yeah, you, this is more dangerous. So oh, shit. Oh, guys. Are you get stuck? Uh oh. Book it, book it. It's gonna blow. Oh. I don't care what you think of me. I told you I was a coward. You weren't a coward. You just attacked a Jaeger. I yeah, I wouldn't call you a coward exactly. Hoggle and Ludo friends. <laughs> See, you got another friend, bro. Thanks for your help. Huh. <laughs> okay, it just opens. Hopefully, we can get through the Goblin City without yeah. um, having to fight like an army. I feel like we can. They don't seem very good as far as brute force. I feel like they're more like sneaky. That's true. But if there's a lot of them. The girl who ate the pizza forgot everything. What of her? She's here with the monster. <laughs> she remembered everything. And they're on their way to the castle. Stop they're on. here already. That's right. Uh, I mean, even if we make it to the castle, there's a <laughs> lot. There's a lot of people here. I think we're gonna make it. Oh, pizza cake. Okay, don't okay, okay, never. Don't drop oh. those lines. Oh, you're totally right. They have numbers. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, they have a cannon. They're not even period accurate. Stay to the time period, man. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh, they completely missed! Come on, Ludo. Oh! You're going the wrong way. <laughs> no, I think he's going the right way, dude. I, I don't blame him, I'm not gonna lie. Like, come on. Oh wow. Okay. These goblins are a little bit uh slow. If you don't turn around this second, I will never feed you again. <laughs> oh. Were well, you gonna face off against all of them? Yeah, freaking armor and stuff. Like, how are we gonna do it? Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> oh no. Oh, we gotta have oh, a. No. We gotta joust. Well, not really joust, but kind of. Kind of joust. Whoa! <laughs> Get wrecked. <laughs> I wonder if uh, Sir Didymus is like an archetype or of a character or something. A little bit, I think. Because, um, uh, you know, with their like companion horse or something like that. Yeah, yeah, very, yeah, yeah. Like, it's like... Because uh, I know in League, like, there's someone who's like, very similar to that. It's a little bit like Don Quixote. A little bit. Oh, maybe that's a bit of a stretch. Yeah, but yeah. a little bit of that like kind of like goofy knight. Um, Ludo, can you like do some sort of... Yeah. Yeah, 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 bring the, the, the houses to life, bro. <laughs> she even dropped the hungry line. <laughs> Watch the mountain just like... What is this? Oh, no. Oh! Rock. He literally has an army of rocks. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are screwed. Imagine having to one be one a rock, bro. Like, <laughs> Imagine being like, seeing a rock come flying at you through the air. <laughs> oh. No! Oh, get wrecked! <laughs> I was about to say, you guys are lighting up like bowling pins. What's that? <laughs> yeah, you're kind of screwed, bro. You, your army got wrecked. Yeah, how are you going to face off against rocks? Whoa! Kind of a weird... <laughs> Whoa! These rocks are smart! Oh no! Our friends! Yeah, we got a man down, bro. Is there rock medics? <laughs> Are there rock medics? Dude, yeah, I don't know. Like, you need some spackle in here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what the? Take him out, Bob. Go, go, go. Let's go! Got him! <laughs> Whoa, that's super cool. Storm the castle. Let's go! Okay. Well, at least we dealt with the goblins. Where is but... he? Where did he hide the baby? Yeah, he said to hide the baby. Yeah. 
Not nah, remember everything gets in us always as it seems. Be careful. Should you need us? I'll call. Hmm. Thank you. All of you. I do think she has to do this alone. Oh. Whoa. It's like the That um, is so cool. It's like that one famous like image or whatever. Yes. Whoa! Yo, this is so cool. This is Whoa. so cool. <laughs> it feels like a music video or something. No, it is. And I, we'll talk more about it afterwards. But like there's this, like, you know, at this time especially, there was like rock operas and stuff like that that people were doing. Like, and just like the style like or something. And the know. style is very much like, it reminds me of like Pig Floyd and stuff like that. Like, okay. like, like very narrative things. Whoa, what? I don't even know how the heck they did this. It's like some Inception stuff. Like, <laughs> holy. Come on. Come on, Sarah. I Dude, wonder if he... Well, we'll see. I, I do think there might be more to it. Yeah. I think you're right. Dude, this music is incredible. <laughs> She's just like, I'm just I, going I feel along. so like, bad for the baby. <laughs> it's like, no, baby, don't. Just stop moving. He's probably having a field day. I'm not going to lie. He's just like, eh, you know. <laughs> that is true. Oh, it's just he's going. booking. My man is just going. He knows how to maneuver this place better than anyone. <laughs> Look, you know that's how babies be. Man. <laughs> like, but they're that one age when they start exploring. <laughs> You're like, what? <laughs> Whoa. That's an awesome shot. Yeah, they do really well on like mixing what's like practical and then like what's like edited into yeah. it and stuff like that. Whoa. 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 Oh my gosh. Dude, Dude. It's legit like some PlayStation game or something. Like, like, yes. It's like a final boss battle. We entered the arena. Bring it on, man. Oh Cut my his hair gosh. off. <laughs> oh no. I have been generous Whoa. up until now. Generous. <laughs> Everything that you wanted, I have done. That is true. I have reordered time. I have turned the world upside down. Somebody in the comments tell me what this camera effect is and how they're doing it. Because you can't just stick an effect over film in the 80s. They're like, what, what is it even? It's got to be some sort of lens or something. That's what I'm thinking. Through dangers and toils and hardships. The line! <laughs> I have fought my way here to the castle beyond the goblins. <laughs> oh, Sarah. Look, Sarah. Look what I'm offering you. No, dude. He seems very desperate. Like. And my kingdom is great. <laughs> That's cool. so little. Yeah, he does seem. Kingdom is great. Oh, don't forget the line. Can no. Line? Shoot. Kingdom is great. I can't. Can you remember? <laughs> no, I can't remember. <laughs> you have no power over me. Oh. Whoa. What's gonna happen? I have no idea. I feel like she's right though. That was the line. I remember her saying that. Whoa. Is he defeated by that? Hopefully. What? He's the owl? Huh. Wait. Toby. Wait. Toby? Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, Toby's looking mega cute, bro. <laughs> Here you are. Yeah, keep Lancelot with you. I'm just looking for like a clue. Like, did anything really happen? I'm not sure. He, he she did have a figure of the Goblin King. We're home. Like right there. And the time timing of like the midnight, them coming home, and the clock. Yeah. And also like the references to the Wizard of Oz. Yes, it's yes, yes. It's got to be kind of like a hint to that. Goodbye, Sarah. <gasps> Wait. And remember, fair maiden, should huh. you need us? Should you need us? For. Any reason at all. <laughs> I need you. All of you. Well, why didn't you say so? <laughs> Wait, what? The heck? Be back, baby. We got a party going on. <laughs> if your parents come in the room right now, they're going to be so confused. <laughs> on so many levels. If I saw that, I'd just, you know, I'd just accept it. <laughs> you know, it's, a, it's a strange time in a person's life. I said date, not like... <laughs> <laughs> that was so cool. That was very, very unique. I like I really liked that movie though. That was so cool. It was like a it was like a, a neo 
it wasn't even because I feel like it was referencing the Wizard of Oz and all these different kind of things. It, it's yeah. very reminiscent of, but I was trying to, and somebody in the comments, please, if you get all the references, but I want to kind of go through some of that because I feel like there was a lot of like fairy tale references and ideas around and different things like that, which is really okay. cool. And whether it's her imagination or not, you can see the pulling from the musicals and the different things like she has like a cat's poster which is like a really broadway musical and a playbill and so there's uh-huh. clearly like the musical element i don't know okay well you said you wanted to go through that i mean i, I don't, don't know did I, you did you feel like it was just the wizard of oz or did you feel like because you were talking about like now i don't know if you remember this but um narnia had been written before right so lord of the rings had been written as well mm-hmm. i feel like the dog reminded me a little bit of do you remember rape cheap from Narnia, the little mouse that's like the noble, like warrior, like really small. Yeah. Little, the the dog the... gave reminded me very much of that, as well as Don Quixote. Oh, but I okay. feel like that maybe could have been. No, know. yeah, that's true. Yeah, but yeah, the, I don't know if if it might have been like that specific. I don't know either. It does feel or just inspired a, by? Yeah, it. yeah. yeah. I, I just really liked how um, I, I'm blanking even on the names, but like I've read, you know, books like this, like when I was growing up, like mm-hmm. I really liked fantasy, fairy tale, whatever, that kind of stuff. Uh, even besides the basics of like, you know, Narnia or Lord of the Rings and uh, like the princess and the goblin or stuff like that. I don't know if anybody's ever read these things. And I loved how they took that idea and the feeling of these kind of worlds in, in, Almost in a way that could be really awkward and weird in a movie, but they mm-hmm. owned it and it felt like one of those books completely, you know, come to life. Not in like a Lord of the Rings where it's like, oh, how do we make this kind of a little more gritty? But it just felt like one of those like kids books that I read as a kid. Yeah. Like completely come to life with kind of like the weirdness and the weird creatures and the nobody's really evil. And it's kind of like you're on a mission and the I, I just thought that was really cool. Yeah. I feel like well, the closest thing that I could, I mean, I haven't read a lot of, of like course. those types of books, but like, I don't know if you've ever read the Phantom Tollbooth or whatever. Mm-hmm. It kind mm-hmm. of it gives me that sort of feel it with does. like the weird like things or something, like yes. the weird creatures. Yes. Or a wrinkle in time. Anybody ever read that? Yeah. I, I like, I, I really liked it. You know, it really was able to bring that um, storybook thing to live action in a interesting and in a way that kind of it it worked you know yes dude and i would never have thought even Mm -hmm. seeing bits from this movie i was like this is gonna be a weird movie like seeing david bowie and stuff i was just like oh okay um it totally works i I don't even really know i almost feel like i want to watch this as like a storyteller to be like, how did you make this work? Because it's such an odd idea, but it totally works. Yeah, just the creativity of, you know, just everything. Like yeah. The different types of creatures. And playing and with the, the the kind of meta storytelling, right? So playing with the cliche of the stepmother, who I feel like wasn't actually that bad. And just yeah, like yeah. different things like that I thought were really cool and clever. And I like the story for Sarah, you know? Like I think that's a, a simple story, but I liked it. I really like that idea of like, mm-hmm. you know, being appreciative, not taking things for granted. Yeah. Um, and I think that's really cool. And I just think the world building and the design of everything was so cool. It just surprised me at every turn. Yeah, for sure. I think they did really well um, with the puppets oh, and things yeah. like that. Oh, like, yeah. you know, I, it was very impressive what they were able to pull off. Um yeah, like all the different different types of creatures that they had to make, and then like, you know, all the movements, like the dancing and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it was really well done. Um, and then also like, it, I wonder if like, um, you know, it's almost like it, the Goblin King was like a representation of like you know, what she daydreamed about almost. And it's like you can kind of like escape into that world. I think so, to, especially kind of. even thinking, maybe it's too meta, but thinking in the context of like Bowie, right? Bowie's like this icon, you know, uh-huh. girls fall in love with, rock star, uh-huh. like legend. Yeah. So I, I do think you might be right 
in that idea of it's like this is like her fantasy kind of literally of like oh, all the rock music she listens to and the yeah. princes and the like evil sorcerer who's really hot and like yeah and then the, like the you know the different types of weird things happen like i feel like it's you know it's supposed to be like are you gonna just live in that fantasy that that sort of like daydream or are you gonna kind of you know yeah look at reality a little bit or something like that and the idea that she has the power yeah. Where it's like, he can give her everything she wants if she lets him. Yeah. Which is really cool. I think it's a really cool idea to play with, sort of. And it's interesting that it's like, you know, they didn't completely go away. In, in fact, it was like the complete opposite. Where it was like, <laughs> you know, I feel like it was one of those movies where, like, you know how in the end it's like, oh, but they're not actually there. It's really there. And then it was and like, they straight pizza on party. party. <laughs> I was like, what the heck? <laughs> You know, if you, I love it. I don't know if they meant it or not, but it's like, you know, well, because they dreaming, you know, or yeah. the fantasy type stuff. It's not, you know, you can still have that. It's not yeah, like you exactly, kill that. Which is why I like it. Because it's not just like, oh, you need to just like smother your childish imagination. Like that would be lame. It's like the yeah. idea of, okay, maybe let's direct it in the right direction a little bit and not like shirk your responsibilities kind of or just be like oh, i hate my brother yeah to but like still appreciate this yeah. as a way to help you right through life just like her kind of friends help her yeah i like that it's interesting yeah i just i can't really get over how clever everything is like like something like the doors coming together and then creating like the big titan thing like yeah I, stuff like that i really think is so cool and the fact that yes of course the effects are dated but things like that for me made me be able to completely look past you know like like it's just very well done and clever the visuals of like the glass shattering when she breaks out of the memory it it was very well done there was clearly just like this very very strong creative vision running throughout this entire story yeah and it was not held back by the effects like it really it it almost was like there were things they were doing and i'm like this is almost ahead of your time like with the castle pieces floating and stuff like this it's like this is actually ahead of your time like what are you doing this is incredible the visuals of the final kind of like boss face off and the weird stare upside down yeah thing is so well done so cool yeah i think it was really well done with their um the visuals and the effects that they they had yes like they did a lot of times where even if they just didn't need to they did the optical sort of illusion stuff and it was like it adds to that element of you know like fantasy or something yes. about the world yes and and like lighting they had the really cool lighting and different things like that they really used i really liked this and then the the rock opera thing i don't know if they meant to do this or not on purpose and i'm not the biggest mu- music person in the world so i may be wrong about this stuff too i'm not gonna pretend i'm like a total expert but <laughs> to my understanding especially during this time period there was a lot of like like pink floyd for example is the big one right where they have like an album where all the songs lead into the next one and it's like a narrative and especially if you listen to pink floyd it sounds exactly like i'm sure bowie had a rock opera too exactly kind of like what they were doing and so it was cool taking that art form which i've always thought was super cool I think the Beatles started it. I don't know. Um, And bringing it into like film and then kind of combining that. Because you're like, oh, it's like a musical. And that's kind of the idea behind, to my understanding, the rock opera, which is like, oh, taking this like unique music style and and making it narrative. And then bringing that into a movie. I thought that was super cool. And almost like I liked how it was just him. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I don't know what you want to, even if you want to get really artsy and be like, well, why was it playing at the beginning? Is it because like she was giving into the fantasy of, because at first I was like, oh, it's cool. They have Bowie in it. And then they were like, oh, you want to just do a bunch of songs? But I, I think maybe there was a little more creative uh, incentive behind it. And I'm not exactly oh, yeah. sure what it means, but I think that's because then he was like singing to her at the end. So I almost think it is part of that, you know, like what you were saying, like that, like uh, tantalizing fantasy. Yeah, it kind almost. of is. I feel. Which is cool. Yeah, I, I loved it. I really loved this movie. It was so well done. The practical effects were mind-blowing. Yeah, and it was very... Uh, yeah, I think it's one of the most unique sort of like movies that I've seen. Yeah, I think there's a few other 80s movies like this. Um, so let us know if you guys want us to watch those. The Dark Crystal, I believe. They, they use these puppets as well. That was a really famous one that I've never seen. Um, and then, you know, Never Ending Story. I don't know. Let us know in the comments if you guys want to go check those out. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. 
feel free to join in the discussion. References, anything like that. If anybody is the baby, I swear, comment. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know who is in that. And really, thank you just for being here, guys. Thank you for watching. As always, full-length reactions up with the Patreon. Next week's reaction, whatever 80s movie you guys vote for this movie here. Also going to be up on our Patreon if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. Give us a little bit of extra support. If you're new here, welcome. Hopefully you stick around. We would love to have you. And if you do, we will see you all in the next video.